Hi, my name is Scott Phillips. So the, the reason we created Playbook was really to help people dream bigger dreams, honestly. It's about medical device entrepreneurship. Uh, we think that pe people, we all learn best by emulating other people. And if, and if we can reference off of people from other places who've done really well, had really inspiring stories, that will help entrepreneurs in the Toronto area. I'm Ying Tam, I'm the Managing Director of Health Venture Services at Mars. Uh, Mars is one of the co-hosts for the playbook. Uh, we've been doing it for two years now and really enjoy the experience. I think it's important to help uh, support and build the ecosystem and so we think it's important to participate. I'm Gil Garland, the CEO of Obio, the founding CEO of Obio. And uh, we are a not-for-profit, industry-based organization dedicated to building a robust health science economy and health science cluster here in Ontario. A large percentage of our membership are med tech companies. Specifically, the, the med tech piece is about a quarter of our membership. The ideal person to attend is somebody who's working in a medical device company, either early stage or it's an entrepreneurial growth company of some kind, probably in the management team, and they want to get inspired and they want to learn some important things. The event has, uh, you know, been really gathering momentum and traction, and uh, that's really uh, shows that there's definitely a need for these kinds of things to happen, um, especially around medical device. There isn't actually a lot of medical device events, uh, generally speaking, and so the fact that uh, we can host this and get people to think outside the box in terms of their core uh, activities, it's really important. For a sponsor, there is no better value for your money than sponsoring uh, the medical uh, device uh, playbook conference in uh, Toronto. Uh, the attendance today was uh, amazing. Uh, the word of mouth after last year was so positive that I think a lot of people uh, registered this year just based on the momentum that was still continuing from last year. And we've had a ton of events in the first half of 2018 and people still turned out for this conference today. So that's a real credit to the value proposition that this conference represents for medtech entrepreneurs.